Hi, this is Tim from Run the Edge, and I'm going to show you how you can sync your Fitbit to the Run the Year 2019 tracker. Before I show you how to sync your Fitbit, I just want to note that you can always go to your homepage, to your calendar, and you can always do manual entry or edit any entry that's already in your calendar, no matter whether you're syncing or not. So if I wanted to do a manual entry, say for the 19th, I can just click on that date, select which type of activity it is. Uh, other is an activity like treadmilling or elliptical thing or a uh, you know daily steps would go into the other category. You can put in miles. Uh, so let's say I did a two mile run this day. Hit add miles and it appears directly into your calendar. And you can also edit synced activities after they come into your calendar, no problem at all. So to sync your Fitbit, you're going to find your name in the upper right hand corner. You can go directly to device syncing or you can go to your account settings and you can go to device syncing from there. You'll find uh, that we can sync with Fitbit, Garmin, and Strava. Since we're going to sync a Fitbit, we're just going to click Connect. Now, before I tell you how to do this, I've already logged into my Fitbit account on another uh, tab on this browser. So when I clicked when I click Connect, I'm already connected to Fitbit. If you're not, it's going to ask you to log in here. So you'll just need to know your Fitbit login name and password. Um, after you do connect to Fitbit you're going to see start date and it's going to sync your miles from that day forward and you can go into the past so if I wanted to go back to say the 18th on my Fitbit I can do that click connect and then you're going to want to choose allow all even though it says stuff like weight and sleep and all that stuff the only information that goes from your Fitbit account into the run the year tracker is miles and it's all of your miles combined activities steps, everything like that, that that produces miles will go directly into the tracker. But you have to select select allow all. If you don't, it'll cause an error uh, with the Fitbit sync. So I click allow. And just like that, I am successfully connected uh, to the Fitbit account. I can then go back to my home page and I will see that miles have come in from my Fitbit. For example, I go back here to the uh, 28th or to the 19th and I can see I had uh, a two mile run that I put in manually and I also have a 0.875 miles worth of walking or steps that I got from Fitbit. That's all you got to do. That's how you sync your Fitbit. Have fun.